I'd like to thank everyone for taking the time to click on this video. This month we will be doing a giveaway on your choice of a beaded hummingbird necklace with six intention crystals or a romance angel oracle deck. Last time this deck went out of print, it sold for up to a thousand dollars. If you would like to be entered into the giveaway, simply just click the like button, subscribe to the channel, and leave a comment on which item you would like to receive. We will announce the winner in the last weekly reading of this month. Hello Pisces, this is Craig from Hacking Spirituality and I'm here to do a love reading on the zodiac sign of Pisces. Sun, Moon, Rising, or Venus. Cross watchers are welcome. Not all messages will resonate because these messages are general. If you want a message that's going to resonate more to your personal situation, you could always feel free to reach out to me to book a personal reading. My website will be in the link in the description box down below. Now let's get on to your reading, Pisces. I'm going to start your reading off by pulling you a card from the Universe Has Your Back Oracle deck. And this is just basically spiritual advice to accompany the reading. What does Pisces need to know, Spirit? What does Pisces need to know? Joy is the ultimate creator. So, I think right now you can create a lot by expressing your joy and being thankful for the things that you do have and showing gratitude or gratuity towards the situation. I definitely think expressing your joy will help you manifest with uh, joy as the ultimate creator coming up. I'm going to pull a card for your energy, then I'm going to pull a card for your person of interest energy. What is Pisces' current energy right now, Spirit? What is Pisces' current energy towards the person of interest? Knight of Pentacles, so you're really taking things slow and deciding if you want to make an offer. This is kind of weighing the risk versus the reward and looking at a situation logically and trying to figure out the best way to come towards it. You may be moving a little slow for your person of interest, by the way, with the Knight of Pentacles showing up. What is Pisces' person of interest current energy right now? What is Pisces' person of interest current energy? The Queen of Cups. So this person is very nurturing, motherly. Um, they have a great deal of emotion and they can express their emotions freely. They, she's extending a cup out, which means she's very open with her love and she definitely... She definitely has no problem masking emotions at all. She is completely nurturing and has a really good heart to her. One of the most positive cards in the deck. Um, this person cares about people. They definitely, they definitely take care of people and they're just a kind person in general. Let's go ahead and pull a card that the two of you share. And even though it's a woman on the card, it doesn't mean that that's a woman, that's just their energy that they're in right now. What is the shared energy between these two? What is the shared energy? Oops. Death. So you two could both be going through transformations right now, endings and beginnings. Um, doors shutting out in life so new ones can open there's just a transference in the middle of this death is an extremely positive card when it comes to tarot this is a card of letting go and receiving new and this is an energy you two are sharing so it's very very positive here let's go ahead i mean the only warning i have here is i feel like your person feels like you're moving extremely slow in the situation and the roles could be reversed if you need to flip the energies. Let's go ahead and pull you a blockage for the situation. What is Pisces' current blockage right now? What is blocking Pisces? 
the sun. So yes, another card. The sun is happiness, illumination, knowing everything in the situation. So one of the blockages might be that you're not quite sure about everything and you don't have all the facts right now. But another blockage for the sun being in this position could be that you're having a difficult time expressing joy right now. Um, there could be some harsh energies you went through in the past. And it's really hard for you to express your joyful, youthful energy when you're still feeling a little bit of pain from this death energy that's showing up in the center of the reading. Let's go ahead and pull you an advice card for this relationship. What is Pisces advice? What is your advice for Pisces spirit? What is your advice for Pisces? Strength. So this is really relying on your laurels, showing strength of character in the situation. Um, sometimes you may have to show some sort of restraint, which is kind of funny because that looks like what you're doing with the Knight of Pentacles being your energy. Um, there may be a need in this situation to hold yourself back a little. Um, and that could be why you're coming off with the Knight of Pentacles. But there's definitely a need to rely on your morals and kind of consider the situation. Ponder it, give it a good amount of thought, but don't take too long in the situation because um, the Knight of Pentacles is a solid energy. They're very grounded and stable, but they move a little slow for most people's taste. So restrain yourself for now, consider your options, and then move forward after you come to a conclusion and don't leave the person waiting too long. I hope you enjoyed your reading, Pisces, and I look forward to doing your next one.